Mom. I drew our family in school today. Oh, wow. I didn't have time to finish Caleb's face. <laughs> Carrie drew two mommies. She told me they're married to each other. My teacher says that all that matters is that people love each other and that they're happy. Hmm. Well, people have their own ideas about what is right and wrong. But what matters is how Jehovah feels. He wants us to be happy, and he knows how we can be happiest. That's why he invented marriage the way he did. You mean one man and one woman? Exactly. Look at Genesis 127. Jehovah created Adam and Eve, male and female. Then in Genesis 2.24, he said that a man will stick to his wife. Later, Jesus said the same thing. Jehovah's standards haven't changed. It's kind of like going on an airplane. What would happen if someone wanted to bring something on the plane that wasn't allowed? They couldn't go on the trip. Right. It's the same with Jehovah. He wants us to be his friend and live in paradise forever. But we have to follow his standards to get there. At Matthew 7, 13 and 14, it talks about the road leading to paradise. To get there, Jehovah says we have to leave some things behind. That means anything Jehovah doesn't approve of. But I want everyone to get to paradise. So does Jehovah. And you know what? People can change. That's why we share his message. So, what can you say to Carrie? Well, I could tell her about the paradise. I could tell her about the animals and the resurrection. That's awesome. Let's practice. 